Tell us what we're seeing. Okay, uh, this is uh, Halo. What you were in earlier is a central hallway that connects the American Royal Building to the Governor's Building. This is Hale Arena, um, basically 5,000 seat arena. Uh, has a ice rink floor. We don't have the ice machines, but there are tubes in the floor, and it's normally used for rodeo and dirt events. When's the last time you had an ice rink? We've never had ice never in here, had, but, it's got but it has the pipes in the floor. That's, that's it, uh oh, kid. back in the day. Well, uh, <laughs> sir, I'm sorry that that was the old building that we tore down oh, in 1992. Okay. So how old is this building? Uh, it was built in 1992. Okay. Uh, it doesn't have the refrigeration equipment, but it has the lines Actually, embedded in the, the floor. Plan. Yes, oh, it was really? part of the Cleaver plan. Oh, okay. 1992 and it seats 5,000. Is that right? Yes, correct. It doesn't look like It five. really doesn't. Uh, the, the, the front rows of bleachers are in uh -huh. for the larger rodeo set. When they're pulled all the way out, it will seat 5,000. Okay. How many events do we have here that we have to pull the uh, none bleachers out? None that we have to pull them out to seat them, everybody know. Okay. Any, anybody on the committee have any questions? Did you pick the weather today? <laughs> What's that? Did you pick the weather it's today? It's not raining. <laughs> I, I think it's a nice facility. The one thing I've noticed when I've been at events here is that the seating kind of has a gentle slope. So if you're at the top of the seating, you're quite a little ways away from the action as opposed to if the slope was steeper. Correct. Correct. The Explorers played here, correct? They That's did. The, the Explorers, Explorers started here, played here for three seasons. Okay. How many people could you seat if you took out the seating and had a steeper slope? I, I don't know offhand to, without having a drawing to do that. It'd be interesting to consider that number. I guess it would depend on if you wanted to go up higher on the wall. Take the top row up higher, more angles, sleep down. So you could probably get the same number if you would make the top seat higher up on the wall. You'd probably get more. You'd get, yeah, if you moved it back, uh-huh. Okay, what should we see next? Uh, we were gonna walk into Lower X Hall, okay. and, which is uh, the exhibit space here. Yeah, we Oh, it is definitely. We're, we're basically running some fans and we just started them a few minutes before we started the tour. Other than that, we don't run the air when we don't have it rented. Oh, that's our, they've, they've heard all that. Okay. And they, it's all this paperwork we've paid them about three okay. times, so. So this is the lower exhibition hall, and there's one above it, the upper exhibition hall. They're this, basically the same size, 86,000 square feet. Uh, you can see it's set up right now on this side for a horse show. So horses will be stalled in these, in these uh, corrals here. Uh, we also do the flower lawn and garden show where it's set up with 10 by 10 booths. So when the horses perform, do they perform at They hail? perform in hail okay. and in Kemper. They'll take them across this breezeway and outside and over up to Kemper. How many stalls do we have for horses here? Oh, what's 800. 800. 800. That takes us through most of our shows. We still have to rent a sizable amount for some of our bigger shows, like our UPHA Saddle Bridge show. We'll land and have 1,200 horses here, I think, for that. Fills the whole, all, all the whole capacity. 1,200? Yeah. So they have to rent the other 400 stalls at that time. Oh. The, uh, we don't supply many stalls as, as our, part of our deal. Governor's building, it was built in 1968 as a companion to the old American Royal Building. In 92, we put a new roof on it and uh, new electrical, new plumbing, new HVAC. And what do they do here? Uh, they also set up stalls in here, the American Royal, and does uh, uh, pins horses.
<laughs> and uh, other livestock. And then we also have a, a flower, lawn, and garden show down here and a couple other shows, a farm show that uses this space, uh, Southwestern Association Farm Show, long-term client of ours. It's, it's an exhibition all during the barbecue? Yes. Dean, you might talk just a little bit about the settling that you have to address in this uh, from time to time. Yes, uh, the floor originally was a concrete floor uh, and uh, it cracked and fell and they started putting pavement on it and it just ex exacerbated the problem and now we're actually jacking it up with foam from the underneath side so about every year we have to go and level out some spots where it's settling but we choose to do that rather than spend two million to put a new floor in it we spent Someone six said it was built on sand it is built on yeah basically this was a dump uh, folks that's going to end the tour here we're going to re -meet, meet and replays in a few minutes, so if you'd like to drive your car around to the north lot, you can park it and it'd be a lot closer than walking from here to there if you wish. If you wish to walk it, follow me because that's what I'm going to do.